next story is creating quite the buzz on the Nine on Your Side Facebook page. <laughs> Forgive me for that. Uh, the <laughs> picture of a wasp-like insect that's been flying around town a lot of people's backyards mine included nine on your side anchor ryan houston has been looking into what these really are and whether anybody should really be worried right uh, that's right guys it looks a lot like a hornet but it's not and don't worry wildlife officials say these little bad boys just want to be left alone it looks like a hornet but it's not <laughs> some have a stinger and are known to kill they are pretty impressive. I'm sure if you've seen them, you've maybe run away a little scared before. I know I have before I knew what they were. Mandy Pritchard doesn't anymore. She says these are just cicada killers. Cicada killers are solitary wasps. Um, they are a native species here in Ohio. And they have a really cool, I think cool, some people think scary life cycle. Pritchard is the team leader at the World of the Insect at the Cincinnati Zoo. She says the cicada killers are only after other cicadas and they're not after humans. They will hunt down cicadas, the females will, the female cicada killers, and they'll take them out midair and they will wrestle them to the ground and they will sting them and the venom actually paralyzes the cicada. She went on to say the males don't have a stinger and the female cicada killer will only attack humans if they're provoked. They fly around pretty aggressively, but honestly they won't bother you unless you deserve it. <laughs> so unless you're picking them up or stepping on one or one gets caught in your clothing or anything like that, they're not gonna sting you. They're, they're way more interested in finding their food source. And if you want to read more about how the cicada killers feed and birth their young, you can find that important information at WCPL.com. All right, Ryan, thank you.